this is a 70 year old lady who came with uh, unconsciousness and she came uh, after a fall she was in a coma and uh, what we found in her brain was this so uh, uh, this is a, a brain blood vessel going to the brain there's a blood supply going to the brain you can see a bulge here so actually the blood vessel in a brain should always be like a tube it should never bulge so here you can see this round thing this is actually a bulge inside the brain vessel and this has bursted inside the brain this has ruptured and the bleeding has uh, gone the blood has gone completely into the brain and this has caused all the problem to her the this is called as brain aneurysm when this happens 50 percent of the patients won't survive when it ble uh, when it ruptures for the first time so this patient was little lucky she was able to come to the hospital so what we saw is uh, so here in the same location, what I have done is we have placed a stent, which is a flow diverter stent. This is a stent which is being placed. So this stent was placed from this area to this area and this covers the aneurysm. So the blood will directly go into the brain. Now the blood will never get into the aneurysm. So this is how the treatment works. This is called as flow diversion. So what has happened now? So as the blood goes, this is the aneurysm. Now the aneurysm is not showing increased flow into the aneurysm the blood is mainly going to the brain this treatment is called as flow diverter treatment and uh, this is very helpful when we are treating this uh, ruptured brain aneurysms which are actually life-threatening